from this to this. Uh oh. Morning. How are you? Oh, not too bad. Hi. Five strategies. Strategy one, management. Prevent your dog from practicing jumping up while you train an alternative. Tethering to heavy furniture. This tends to increase excitement, so it's not an ideal solution. Crating. Gradually move the crate Jessie, further yeah. from the doorway to your preferred location as long as your dog is successful four to four tries. Lucy, come on! Here is the final location of the crate. Good job. Behind a barrier. Here's a creative use of an X pen to create an airlock. Desensitize dog to arrivals. Drop treats Good on the job. floor Good girl. to divert your dog's focus to the floor Good until job. she calms down. Good. Block eye contact. Use your hand to block her vision. Transition the hand block to your visitor. It helps if your dog already knows how to do a nose target to hand. She, she sticks her hand like right into my hand. Free Mac recalls. Recalling your dog away from the visitor helps to keep greetings brief so jumping is interrupted before it happens. Sending her back desensitizes her to the person if you do several repetitions. Here we have graduated to recalling while letting the person in. Look for the visitor's hand block. I time my recalls before she jumps. See how much more she focuses on me? She's I left it a little too long that time. Gradually increase the interaction time with the visitor. Oh, what a good girl. Okay, go say hi. Very nice. Calm. Maybe we do the eye block too if you need to. If you think she's going to jump. Good job. Repeat until the dog is calmed down or is bored. The visitor moves away from the doorway. This changes everyone's focus off the dog and further calms her down. Train an incompatible behavior. Go bed. Practice having your dog to go to his bed when the doorbell rings or someone knocks. Then practice opening the door to let them in. Reward her heavily for staying there at first. Put a toy in your mouth. This works well for dogs who jump to mouth the visitor, like Goldens in labs. Four, put the behavior on cue. By teaching your dog to jump on cue, you control when your dog jumps. Check out my stimulus control video. Cue the jump off to the side when your visitor comes in. Good job. And then just walk in the house. Good job. Five, elevate your dog. Raising your dog up puts him where he wants to be, closer to your face. This decreases the greeting frenzy and removes the need to jump. Using a platform just to the side of the door keeps him on the spot. Jesse starts offering to sit.